Hello, this is Buona from Buona.tv, and today I have another question from the Q&A on Twitter. This person used the Twitter hashtag BuonaTVQA, and they put a pound sign in front of it and put BuonaTVQA, and I look at that every week on Twitter to see what questions people are asking. So if you're on Twitter, you should try this too. So today's question is from The Captain, spelled with a D, The Captain. He says, what is your recommendation for the best, comma, most comfortable computer chair available. Which one do you use? I get a lot of compliments on my chair when I stream because people can see it when I stand up. Um, you can kind of see it in the background there. I'm not going to show you, but I'll give you a link to it. Now, the recommendation for the best, most comfortable chair is highly opinionated question. Um, me, I live in Florida. Uh, in case a lot of people didn't know, and it gets kind of toasty here, and I'm generally in front of my computer a lot. So I prefer mesh chairs, M E S H, mesh chairs. They don't have the 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 chair material like leather or pleather or whatever have you that you you're probably used to seeing. These are the chairs that are all made of this this cloth mesh like material, um, and it allows your body to breathe as you sit down. You don't sweat when you sit out uh, and it allows the, the body to aerate and whatever you it's probably scientific reasons that I, I can't understand why this is good but generally I'm comfortable in a mess chair now when you search for chairs there are three features that I think are essential to a comfortable chair uh, this is my opinion number one I think I already said mesh so I don't know if I'm gonna count that I'm gonna say mesh number two is a headrest. A lot of chairs that you look for today, they don't come with a headrest. When I lean back, I like to put my head back on, on a headrest instead of going I like headrests. So I think headrests are generally important and they assist with good posture. So headrests are good. The next thing is lumbar support. You're probably asking, what in the world is lumbar support? Lumbar is back support and it generally is a strip that you can put on the chair that you can slide up and down. I prefer adjustable lumbar support that supports your mid back or lower back section that promotes good posture. So when you have lumbar support, you can sit in a good posture position and it supports the lumbar or the, the lower part of your back. And you can adjust that up or down depending on what's comfortable for you. Um, I've taken a lot of, um, of ergonomic courses and one of the things they, they don't want you to do is slouch or to sit or lean back. They want you to sit straight up and, you know, a lumbar chair will help you do that. So that's the other thing. And another thing I like is armrests. Uh, look for chairs that have armrests. If you get a chair without armrests, sometimes you'll, you'll use a keyboard improperly, uh, especially with computer chairs because your arms will go down like this instead of being, you know, straight on the keyboard like this should be armrests help promote that so when I buy chairs I think about ergonomic stuff now with all of these features you got mesh you got lumbar support you got headrest and you got armrests the price can be a little pricey but I found a site and I got a great deal on it and I actually saw today that the price has gone up on the chair the name of the site is called bizchair.com that's B as in boy I Z as in Zeta chair Dot com and the, and the model that I have is the Air Grid Executive Chair. Its number is 37166 by Office Star. And uh, I believe this is the, the, it looks exactly like the chair I have. I looked up the exact model number and I couldn't find it. But I'm looking at this chair and I'm pretty sure that's it. Um, the chair retails <laughs> for $915. When I got mine, it was, I have the email here, it was, I think it was around, it was 350 bucks when I got it. So it retails for around 1000 I got it for 350 Now they're selling it for uh, $469. So yeah, you can find mesh chairs on bizchair.com for cheaper, but you're going to sacrifice headrests. You're going to sacrifice armrests, and you're going to sacrifice lumbar support. Those things are crucial to comfort, in my opinion. You get what you pay for. If you get a chair without lumbar support, you'll notice. 
you get one without armrest, you'll notice. If you get one without a headrest, you'll, you'll notice. Um, once you sit in one of the chairs I got, you don't want to go to the other ones anymore. Unless you want to slouch, you know. If you use good posture, these chairs promote good postures and you get what you pay for. But with mess chairs, you can, they can be very, very expensive as you see on this site. Uh, but I do recommend this site. They have prompt shifting quality product. I had this chair for a couple years and it's doing me very well. Uh, my posture has improved a lot. I used to slouch a lot more than I do now. All right, this is Buona from Buona.tv, and I hope I answer your question, the captain. This is these are my recommendations for a, a good, comfortable chair. You gotta have lumbar support. You gotta have a headrest, armrest, and I prefer mesh. Like I said, this is all opinionated. And where I got my chair from, it was uh, from BizChair.com, and um, I got I already named it. I'm not gonna name it again because I'm not gonna be able to remember it. All right, take care, the captain. Thanks for the question.